Now I would love to go over different setups that you that, that we could do off of just the arms. How is it that we could grab and pull with with uh, uh, unorthodox type techniques and with your traditional uh, ties to to certain takedowns. So again, we're here. I, I would like to start off with, uh, with something that I saw. Actually, a friend of mine actually showed me, but he saw it up in Mongolia by the name of Tony Dianda. He's the one that showed me this technique. And what he said, what he saw uh, overseas in Mongolia, and he got caught in it, and he was a super technical wrestler, is the fact that we're so accustomed to grabbing the wrist like so, right? But these dudes would grab the wrist across, and then what they would do next is they would find the bicep. They would find so they would they would wrestle find find the find the wrist and then they would find the bicep and then from there what they would do they would just pull to the takedown to all the fundamental stuff that I was going over and how to how to position right so again even a setup is what you can do is you can cross wrist here grab the bicep pull to your shot to the takedown here here I'm literally just cross gripping here grabbing the bicep pull to my takedown even here if you guys notice here like i'm catching his arm here between this leg that he's here you see what i'm saying but now with every with every uh technique i'm gonna go over a different takedown so here i'm grabbing wrist i'm grabbing bicep i'm pulling i'm coming up to this leg i gotta come up i gotta remember cast the leg here i'm coming up like so now what i'm gonna do is I'm gonna hook this leg here. I'm gonna hook it like this. I'm gonna grab the waist and watch. I'm gonna so I'm gonna be extended here, and I'm literally gonna uppercut and take my whole body going forward for the takedown. So I'm here. I'm gonna grab the wrist. I'm gonna grab his bicep. I'm gonna pull him to me. I'm gonna step, catch my takedown. I'm gonna cast here, up. Now I'm gonna sneak this leg in here. I'm gonna spike up here. I'm gonna grab his waist, cause I still gotta control that joint. And I'm literally gonna uppercut, even if I have to keep hopping to get it, but I gotta get it and I gotta do it, right? Because remember, he's on one leg. As much as you're on one leg, he's on one leg too, right? So we're here. I cross grip it, I find that bicep, I pull him to me. I pull him, to, as soon as I pull here, people don't expect, people expect the traditional stuff. So when you reach across, grab the bicep, and you pull, you're here. I'm casting up, I'm using my head to come up. I am doing here, like so. I am nice and extended. I am nice and extended, I'm finding that waist, and I'm going above that knee. I'm sorry, I'm uppercutting that knee, and taking, the, taking my weight forward for the takedown. Careful too during practice because because you have that leg extended when you do take them down. You can end up in a match, everything goes good in practice. I stay right there. Careful, careful smashing this guy down like so. You know, even careful even finishing the lock in practice. Remember, it's a lot of car wreck and car action that you do. Just understand the techniques. Uh, and you know sometimes you do have to uh, go through the motions while understanding that you got to keep your opponent healthy. So again, I'm gonna, I can maybe even start here, switch up, find the bicep, pull him into me. I can stay high if I want. Boom, going in for the takedown. Another uh, another technique that I love too is even off of setting people up, setting people up with the. Uh, with the arm drag, right? There's there's two different arm drags I like to do. Uh, there's one that cuts off time a little bit more than where I can go to my, uh, whether it's my low single, whether it's my single leg, whatever that may be. And it goes, so there's two different type of arm drags. There's the one that goes down, you wanna go down and across, right? And there's the other arm drag. Where he's here, you wanna go wax on. People say wax on, wax off, but I don't see the, I see the wax on, I don't get the wax off because you're this way, you're in this motion. Remember, wax on, bring them into you, right? That's that, th those are the two arm drags that we see, right? So again, we have uh, we have the cross grip bicep, and now I'm gonna cut the time because I'm gonna go with it, I'm gonna go with this one, I'm gonna pull 
eventually to get to my single leg or or my low single i'm sorry or uh we're gonna bring them down here we're gonna pull to my single leg right so again i got the bicep like so and now i got this here right i'm gonna bring i'm gonna bring this down as i pull i'm gonna catch my i'm gonna catch my single leg come up hook the leg find the waist bring it bring them down like so so we're here i got two options i can smack them down to the single leg or i can set them up cross grip it find that bicep pull them into me to my shot for the eventual takedown let's switch sides let's go from this side here a cross grip find that bicep pull them pull them Casting that leg, bringing that leg up, hooking, hooking, finding waist, taking the whole metal forward, and then take down. Or we can smack it once, we smack it again, but now we're gonna take advantage of this position. Notice how my toes are. All right, we're gonna get up, right, find the waist. Uppercutting this opponent, uppercutting my opponent for the takedown. So these are some of the varieties of competing with somebody that um, countering somebody while using their their limbs to get takedowns, right? So th that's those are a couple of series that I like to do off of me uh, catching and finding uh, uh, the arms.